Welcome back to the channel. Today's day 153 of this 300 days fitness challenge. Today's exercise is right on the screen along with our daily checklist and a list of the items we're going to need until the end of this challenge. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to the channel and pound the like button. Let's get to it. Let's take our first break. Finally made it to 20 reps on the pull-up bar. It only took 153 days to make that happen. Gosh. Ah, those were good reps for sure. All right, first set is complete. We have three more sets to failure, just like that one. The only difference is gonna be that I'm not gonna be able to do 20 <laughs> on the next set. I'll be lucky if I do half of what I just did there. Let's not do the exact same thing I did yesterday. I don't want to choke my rest there. But anyway, first set done. Three more sets to go, all of them to failure. Then we'll do the rows, bend double rows, but we're gonna do them with dumbbells today again. Uh, we'll try to keep a decent form. And then we'll come back up to the bar with chin ups or underhand grip pull ups whatever you want to call them. <laughs> uh, and also with those, we'll try to keep the tension on the lats, not on the biceps, since I already worked out biceps yesterday, which by the way, that was an insane workout for me yesterday. My arms were sore all night long. <sighs> Luckily it was, I think it was like 23 degrees last night and with the wind chill it felt like 10 degrees it was cold so that cold air uh, kind of numbed my arms <laughs> for a couple hours so I was more focused on the pain in my fingertips and my toes than the pain or the soreness on my biceps all right, just a few more seconds to go and we'll get back to the bar. It's important to stay hydrated regardless of the temperatures. All right, time is almost up. As soon as I'm done putting this thing on, Be right back up. All right. Here we go. Time for our second break. Um, not completely sure what happened on that second set. 
probably was too much or too focused on the quantity of the reps over the quality. In other words, I was kind of focused on doing 10 more than I was thinking about uh, the exercise, how it's supposed to activate my lats or engage my lats. But it's okay. We have two more sets to make up for that one. <laughs> ah. Now I do feel the exercise, just not as much as I would like to feel it. <sighs> After a while you get to know what part of your body each exercise works and you get to learn your body as you work out, which is pretty cool and good. <laughs> All right, time still ticking. Got a reminder, I need to loosen my gloves up after each set. Because it seems like I'm tying it down really tight. It's kind of choking my, my uh, wrist there and restricting the blood circulation. And what I need right now as I'm resting is for the blood to flow throughout my entire body including my arms, my lats, legs, oxygen to the brain, everything. Okay. We are under a minute to go on this break. And then we'll go to do our third set. I'll try to go a little bit slower, which means I'll do less reps. But at this point, it doesn't matter. I want the quality of the exercise over the quantity. Oh man, I can't do this now for some reason. Here we go. All right, time is up and here we go. Actually, let me just make sure, yep, I'm focused. Take another break. <sighs> Definitely felt that one, every single rep from the first one to the last one. I know my rep count, <laughs> my rep count went down significantly there. <sighs> but again, it's not about the quantity, it's the quality. Got to remember that myself too. That's... Let's see. Let's just make sure the transmitter is transmitting. So you actually, you guys can actually hear me. All right, so as the time is ticking, let me do a little bit of multitasking here and check my work standing. Yes, looks, how, looks like I'll be working tonight. And let's see if I'll be able to choose a job. I doubt it. Today's Second, one, two, three, 
Four jobs showing. Uh, well, I don't. I won't really have a choice. Oh well. I'll work. It doesn't matter. I'll get paid anyway, right? Regardless if I get to choose or not. All right. So one more set. And then we'll do the rows with the dumbbells. I'll have to move you guys back a little bit. So you guys can get a better angle. And talking about getting a better angle, I will probably be making some changes around here. Where is the fog? So the background might look a little bit different sometime soon. How soon? I have no idea. Whenever I get free time for me to play around here in the shed, move things around, throw things away. All right. Just a few more seconds. All right, here we go with our last set of pull-ups. All right, let's take a break. Sometimes I miss the, ho the hooks. But recently I want to have, I'd rather have the connection with the bar than trying to stay on it. Now I might use the hooks for leg races on the core and cardio days. All right, while the time is ticking, let's move you guys to your regular spot. <laughs> All right. Should be fine. Right there. There you go. I already have the dumbbells set. And just like last week, they are loaded with 40 pounds each. So we'll be able to row with it as it is. And again, just like last week as well, I need to focus on the form, having a good form and do decent reps. Quantity, not too important. I know I can pull it. Just need to make sure I do it right and then we'll go from there time is still ticking oh. Oh. it's funny how I look like I work out when I'm working out. When I'm not working out, I look like I work out. Uh, and it's still kind of too soon for me to tell about my diet change, which is not really a change. I just added 100 calories to my diet. I'm trying to also eat more proteins than I used to. Or I should say, I, I'm trying to eat some more calories from proteins than what I used to. Most of my calories were from carbs and junk. I'm trying to have proteins more from, uh, I'm trying to have my, my calories from protein sources. All right, time is up. 
And here we go. It's gonna be uh, hard, but here we go. Take a break. Definitely felt that one. Woo. Even though at times I was going a little too fast, then I caught up myself and slowed down a little bit. Definitely felt every rep in there. Three more sets of this exercise. Then we'll go back up to the bar. Whew. I don't know why, but that set definitely is making my heart go. My back is feeling good. No pain at all. I mean, my lower back. And I still, I still on defense on doing deadlifts. We'll see if we will ever <laughs> add deadlift to, to the list of exercises. All right, time is still ticking. I'm trying to <laughs> recover from that set. That was a good one for sure. We're still over a minute to go on this break. We'll see how the second set goes. I know I did a pretty good amount of reps on the first one. Which means that I can probably add some more weight. But I'm not completely sure about it yet. So, next week, I feel like I said this last week too. But last week, <laughs> next week, I'll add more weight to this exercise. I'll probably do it with, with the dumbbells loaded with 50 pounds instead of 40. All right, time is up. And here we go with the second set of this exercise. Time for another break. The exercise is dual. However, it's 
like you have to know what you're doing because here you're supposed to pull with your elbows you're supposed to pull back but it's hard to disengage your biceps and your wrist from the exercise since the weight is in your hands so the point is to pull with your elbows because as you pull back it engages the lats on the exercise if you're pulling with your biceps it takes some of the whew, let me breathe if you pull with your biceps it takes from your lats which is what you're trying to work out it's kind of hard to disengage your arms when everything is hanging on your arms but it's doable it's doable it just takes a little bit of practice and knowing what you're doing not knowing what you're doing but getting to know your body and how it works and how it's doing the exercise feeling the exercise takes a little bit to know you're doing it right or wrong Whew. Whew. all right so two more sets of this exercise and then we'll climb back up I need to get out of here so I can take a little nap it's gonna be a little nap okay where's my phone fiance just send me a text Time is almost up. Just a few more seconds to go. We'll do this, the third set of this rows. And then we go back in. <sighs> well, not back in, we'll go back up. <laughs> to do pull ups. Or as I call them, chin ups. <sighs> All right, that's it. All right, here we go. <laughs> uh, uh. Take our last break of this exercise. I gotta fix something here. Sorry about my awkwardness here. Whew. Having a little conversations with the fiance. 
Okay. All right, we're back in business. All right, time's still ticking. We have one more set of this exercise and we climb the bar again. Last night being in the cold, it was even hard to drink water, really hard. I was getting dehydrated faster than what I was getting hydrated. Cold temperatures were making me burn more calories than what I wanted to. <laughs> Not more than what I wanted to, but then I, what I anticipated was gonna happen. It was, it was a rough night, so I had to drink some extra, or I had to take some extra electrolytes to rehydrate myself. It was rough. <laughs> However, we did just fine. At least last night I got a chance to go to shelter at least three times. All right, time is up. And here we go with the fourth set of this exercise. Take a break. All right, I'm done with the dumbbells. I'll have to go back to the bar soon. I can definitely feel it more with the dumbbells than with the bar. But, gotta keep it. Gotta keep innovating here, keep changing it. Gosh. Well, we're making progress for sure. Even though <laughs> the picture's on day 151. Doesn't look much different than the picture before. In a way, it looks like I probably gained some weight in the most recent picture. But regardless, We're making progress. A lot of progress compared to day one. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> All right, time is almost up. Well, I still have a few seconds to go. I'm still taking it here. Whew. 
so after this break we still have four more sets of chin-ups thereafter I'm going home I mean I'm going across that wall take a nap until the phone rings as usual uh, I know time is up but I need to see okay I didn't know what today was <laughs> all right Time is up and here we go. Time for a break. Ah. This is one of the biggest distractions. Cell phones at the gym. <laughs> Woo. work today oh. we have three more sets and that's it and that will be it for today let me let my body breathe And if you're wondering, yes, still cold here in PA. It is really cold. Probably too cold. that look like I've been working out. I mean, they look like that right now, but <sighs> the rest of my body, not so much. <laughs> um, now, I do not have the overhang fat that I had at the beginning of the challenge, for sure. Uh, my love handles are not as hard nor as pronounced as they were either. Still have them. But making a decent progress. I'm gonna push it like this with this extra 100 calories for a little bit <clears throat> until we are closer to the end of the challenge. All right, just a few more seconds to go. We'll be climbing that bar again. Oh. All right, time is up. Here we go. Take another break. Two more sets. That's it. Definitely feeling the lats.
I can feel some, <laughs> it's gonna sound ridiculous, but I feel a little bit of separation going on. My muscles are getting a little bit defined. Even though I'm working out the body part only once a week. I could be doubling the results or doing it or getting results twice as fast if I would have been working at least same body part twice a week. Oh, looks like the microphone receiver is about to die. <laughs> I'll keep an eye on it. We should be able to finish this video. Two more sets, six more minutes. I think we have this. Well, chin ups are like at the end. I don't even know. Oh man, you guys didn't get much action from the chin ups, did you there? You probably didn't even know if I was doing chin ups or what the heck I was doing. <laughs> All right, at least you'll see the last two sets of the chin ups. All right. All right, just a few more seconds. Let's bring that thing back down. Ah. Oh, I think leg days, if it's not tomorrow, it's the day after tomorrow. Legs are way overdue. Way overdue. All right, time is up. Here we go. Last break. Oh, my hands don't want to hold me up there anymore. We have one more set. We're gonna call it today. excited only have one more set and I'm done with this and to the end of this challenge <laughs> I still have a few days to go <laughs> however we passed the halfway point already already passed the halfway point <sighs> am I looking at the most recent, most recent picture. I agree, we are past halfway point. <laughs> almost look, well not almost look like, but I'm like a like striking distance from being at my goal. I just chose to 
reduce my deficit, not to be so high on that calorie deficit. And then, ah, trying to gain some more muscle before I go back to the deep deficit and get shredded, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I know. I don't know how lean I'm gonna go. Or oh, I should say, I don't know how lean I'm gonna get. It is difficult. Like, it gets to a point where you're hungry. <laughs> you're hungry, but not just for food, but you want the bad stuff that tastes good. And when you're trying to get that lean, you definitely have to steer away from those delicious foods that are not so good for you. All right, just a few more seconds. And we'll be hanging on that bar. All right, time is up and here we go. That's all I can do. Whew. I'm gonna be sore today and tomorrow. All right, that was it for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Adios.